Dragon's Den star Deborah Meaden has paid an emotional tribute to her former Strictly Come Dancing partner Robin Windsor. Windsor, who died aged 44 earlier this week, competed with Meaden in the 2013 series of the BBC One dancing show. In a tribute post on Instagram and X, Meaden described the news of Windsor's death as devastating. She said she was thinking of his family, friends and loved ones, who, will be aching at the loss. Robin was a good man, she continued. He was kind and incredibly generous, supporting so many charities, helping so many people and giving so much of himself wherever he went. Windsor and Meaden were the fourth couple to be eliminated in the 2013 series of Strictly and also took part in the show's Live UK tour the following year. Meaden recalled, he taught my mother to dance for her 80th birthday party and they whirled around the dance floor at her party. He knew how to make people feel good. He was also complex and human and open about the struggles of life after the limelight. I was lucky to have known you Robin, it's hard to know you are gone. During his time on Strictly Come Dancing, Windsor was also paired with Patsy Kensett and Anita Dobson, both of whom were eliminated eighth, and Lisa Riley, who made it to the semi-final. The year after Windsor partnered with Meaden, he was forced to pull out of the dancing series due to a back injury. But although he was not partnered with a celebrity, he did return to the show part way through the 2014 series and appeared in group dances with the other professionals. He also continued to appear in the Strictly Christmas specials until 2015, when he competed with Alison Hammond. After his death was announced, a huge number of Strictly stars past and present paid tribute to Windsor including hosts Tess Daly and Claudia Winkleman, judges Darcy Bussell, Craig Revel Horwood, and Shirley Ballas, and pro-dancers Auti Mabuse. Windsor's cause of death has not been confirmed. He had most recently been starring in Come What May, a Moulin Rouge tribute show. The dancer was also an advocate for mental health and worked closely with the same charity.